Hi, my name is Craig Thompson Wood. I'm the board game teacher. Thanks for coming to the classroom. I want to do another video about City of Zombies today, and not necessarily as a video about how the game is played, but an actual playthrough. Because as I've been doing this, I've been doing this on a daily basis for months now with my class. Every day we spend a few minutes on what we call a mindful entry, where I take a group of students of like ability in their mathematical skills, and we play City of Zombies for the first 10 minutes. We play five rounds. And I've been so impressed with watching their, their skills develop that I thought I would share with you, the viewer, uh, to see how they're doing with their math and how these kids are developing in, in their, their flexibility of thinking with their math facts. So let's not uh, waste any more time. Let's take you right to the table and I'll show you a game and play. Uh, the board is all set up for City of Zombies. Uh, with the group I'm playing with today, we're doing level one, two, and three zombies. Uh, which means that we've activated three heroes here. So the heroes uh, will allow this one that they can use the dice for a second turn on their turn. Uh, this one, they can change the dice face to one face of their choice. In this one, if there's a zombie, say one in front of another zombie, you can kill that one. Then you kill the one behind it too using Masaka, Masaki, Mas Masaki? Masaka. This guy. That's his name, this guy. All right, so we have one, two, three, four survivors. And when we play, because we're only playing for uh, like 10 minutes of the first part of the morning, we only start at level five. Everybody gets 30 seconds on a, on a timer. And once the thir first 30 seconds is done, then the team can offer suggestions for the second 30 seconds, after which time, if nothing, no decision has been made, then they've lost their turn. All right, so uh, I, we have five people here today helping out with this, and let's begin. So why don't you roll down close to the board, so make sure that the dice rolls get on the, on the, ta on the, on the video. So three, four, five, and away we go. So tell me, think out loud what you're doing. Um, uh, five times four is 20, subtract three, 17. Okay, so we've got the 17. Okay, uh, now, He's got 15 seconds, but at this point, because he's made a decision, the other people can make suggestions if they see something better. Anybody? No? We're good with that? 17 is a prime number, so it's a tricky one to get, so that's a good choice. All right, so 17 is gone. Move on to the next. Six, five, three. We'll just put it on the board there so we'll make sure that it's on, on the screen. Okay, now the team can suggest. Yeah? Wait, uh, you can get the eight, you square the three, and you uh, subtract the other to one, and then you uh, minus to get the eight. Subtract. Okay. Good. Oh, okay. you can get the ten. But okay. it's adding the one. Okay. So, all right. So that that um, which would you prefer? The, the ten. 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 One each four. So, I'd rather get him out. Six Ooh. three three. <coughs> So with one like the 37, you really have to think ahead how you might get that one. So, actually, yeah, I can get the 12, I can get 37. You could? Yes. You can get the okay. uh, Well, oh, wait, wait, is there anybody else? Saw him? Um, uh, six times, uh, square the six oh, is 36, divide the, the two, both of the threes, which is one, add it, the 36, you can get the 30. Seven yeah, and he's a nasty one. He yeah. eats eight. Eight? Eight, yeah, and he's, he's, he's nasty. But what if we don't have eight survivors, then what do well, you do? He, just, he takes everything that he can. Okay, um... At this point, we do have eight. Yeah, we can get uh, those. Oh, I see four. 
And that's a minus one. Square this, add this, and then you can multiply by one. Okay. Or you can also or you can multiply these and minus one to get eight. Yeah. Or you can do three minus three that equals to zero minus one that equals to minus one. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Take out. Yeah. Yeah, but he abducts, so he's not as bad. But he abducts four. Okay. Abducts. So which one do you want? Don't take the abduct. Which one eats more? Um, Both of them eat the same. Let's take the eight. Yeah, eight is harder. This six, this you can get a little bit more. Six and three. Actually, you get more waste than eight. Three and five, oh, yeah. four and four. It's possible to get both out. Not with that one. Okay, so we have a four, five, six. Which one gives you the second? Now chance? remember too, you could have used Amanda to use those dice because we you said you could have got the eight and the twelve. If you use Amanda, you could have got the twelve too. Why don't you do that? Yeah. Well, we'll sort of backtrack a bit just to show the power. So her power, she could, he could use the same dice. He discussed how he could have got both of them with the one roll. So using Amanda, he's able to use those dice for two different times. Now all it means is that we're leaving the, the last person here to get the negative one. Yes. You can't get negative one. Yeah. You cannot? No. No. Not with those fingers. I can use this and I'm thinking about it. You can do like six, I mean, five minus six equals two minus one, then you have to do something like Yeah, if you use like Joe. Remember, there's a pizza delivery in here too that will refresh the heroes. Yeah, you, yeah, if you use Joe, we can do, uh, we can subtract this, make him some to one, and then multiply by one, make it still. Yeah, that's what minus I think one. about. Can I do that? But it won't get it out. It's one. So, oh, it's minus one. So, how would that work? Sorry? So, we so you do like so you do like six and five minus I'm assuming my way. So you do mm -hmm. five minus six, that equals to minus one, then you change this to a one and then you do times one. Yeah. Okay, sure. And that would get that. So in clearing out all the zombies then, uh, that was the turn, so the plane moves down to four and Oh. <laughs> Survivor, wow. we're being attacked by survivors. <laughs> so three more survivors come down. One, two, three. First we get one, two, three, four, and now we get one, two, three. Uh, and now we're going to oh, get one, two, three, we're going to get one. It's so weird. And with five people playing, you're going to get the full allotment of zombies. If you play with less, then if you roll, you can roll and take the highest number. But in this case, we're taking them all. Okay, so that's our meeting of zombies. Pizza. Four, six, one. Thirty-six. Oh, you could get eleven. Or I got nineteen. Huh? I got nineteen. Yeah. Twenty-three. Oh, oh, my nineteen. Oh, I see nineteen. Can I see it? The 19, yeah. But you should get 11 because it eats 5. Okay, okay, I'll say how you do it. Yep. So you do 5 plus, I mean, 4 plus 1, that equals to 5. 5 times, and then you power it, that equals to 25. And then 25 minus 6 equals to 19. Okay. Or you, oh, you should get to 11 by adding it. I heard it's another way for 19. Yeah. Be, but you can get that easily. 36. You can and get that on a roll of two dice. You can also yeah. get 23. Mm -hmm. okay. How's that? Uh, it four times uh, no, four times four, uh, which is sixteen plus the six, uh, then plus uh, the one. So what's four? Four plus four is sixteen. 16 plus six is tw twenty-two, and then add one. Yeah, let's get to twenty-three. It's no, let's get nineteen. He eats more. more. He eats more. But twenty-three but is harder to get. Yeah. No, twenty-three you can also get it with two. With no, five but he eats two. more. So you can get that with two as well. Nineteen, you can't get with two dice. No, you can get it with four and a three. Okay, there you go. See. Planning ahead. All right, so 23 then, and, and then and it is to roll. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's nice. That's a good roll. No, it's not. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I got yeah, one. Get get I got oh. seven. You can get 19 with that. I know. Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, I got it. Three times three that equals to nine plus these two. Nine, four, nineteen. Okay. 
Okay. Moving on down the line. You could get eleven. Oh, you can get twelve. Eleven. Three plus twelve, subtract one equals eleven. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, those are, easy. those are easy. So yeah, you could get them out with one dice, except for seven. How do you get the one out? Three yeah, you could get the one Look out. Look at the three out. Yeah, you can get the three out. You can sub subtract these, which is equal to three, divided by six, which what? makes... Oh, wait, wait. Three divided. Oh, minus six. Yeah. yeah. Which equals like three. Yeah, do that. Okay. Wait, well, or you we could, could do, do minus, minus one. Or you could do uh, six minus five, which equals one, plus the two, which is equal to... You can All also right. get the one. Yeah. But the okay, but uh So you could get it's up you to could you. get one by yeah, the You just need to get one. You could have got the seven. No. Three one you one. Oh no. Use look for must You could get the seven. Okay. Yeah, you can get the Time seven. Times that yeah. like it's by itself and then minus the two. So we square, three squared is No, but nine, nine to use nine the minus minus two. Two. Equals okay. seven. You want to get both of them. Let's see if you can. No, he he will kill things that are behind the yeah. zombies are behind oh. it. That doesn't it's work here. Well do All right, no. so one zombie could survived get, that round. They could have got the, the one survived. Nine. That means you're not a kid. Nine. All right, so he comes I'm down. Not a kid. And then we put no, it, and that together. comes down to three now. Not and then we have another one. No sudden rush. rush. Oh. Oh. Yes. We Why are we? Why are we so scared about starting wars? That's just one. It's just a 32 death. Well, <laughs> you want everything you can get. Okay, so we have 4-4 four, four, and a 1. 9. <laughs> okay. Right. Now we're possibly need to look at trying to get two zombies. How? I'm just saying, just, I'm not saying it is 16, possible. 16, 20, 21. Yeah, you can get Actually, I can get two. Yeah. Yeah, you can get 32. Oh, and then almost. Oh, like, uh, square the four, both of the fours, which is um, 16. Add them, 32. And the one, just kill this one because it's closer. Right. And he's no, but he has two. So but he's closer. Yeah. yeah. All right. And yeah, that's exactly what I saw. So I think that's better choice there. Uh, if we use Masaka, we still could have used to get them. Oh, yeah. You should have took out. You should have done yeah, you should have just took out this one then. But the one that was oh, him. Oh, oh, I got it. See? No, I didn't get it. <laughs> I got it. Oh, no. Yeah, I didn't oh are you kidding me? Are this you kidding me? You got nine. Don't overthink it, Jess. Yeah. You got one. It's easy. It's oh. oh. just, just wait. He's got 15 seconds. Oh, yeah, I got it. This plus two. this that equals to 11, and what? 11 minus 2 that equals to 9. Oh, okay. you can get 2 out. Right. Right. So, so, so he's got the. Get 1 and 2. But I don't want Anybody two. else from the group? Okay, okay. yeah. You can do the 6, the 5, then the 2. Oh, oh my god! god. Oh, yeah. 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 That's what I said. Don't overthink it. Sometimes you, you think of all these crazy, complicated things, but sometimes if you can just match the dice, you know, uh -huh. like that. Boom. Oh. Knock out 3 in one shot. Wow. Wow. wow! wow! I don't even know. How do you wow. get so lucky? Okay, so how do you do that? So you you power the three, so you do three squares. You could get nine. both of them right now. How? Three one times squared three. is still one. <laughs> you could get both of them. How? Do you do it? If you, I can't suggest. Yeah. Wait, can you suggest? Yeah, I'm not seeing anything. How? Okay. Three times three is nine. Oh. And then one. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, see? Sometimes, this is one thing I love about the game. Sometimes the students outsmart me. I'm like, how do you do it? I don't see it. So we still have two people left to go in the group, but they've already beaten it. So what they'll do is they'll start the next round now, but we get three more survivors. Wow, that's Two, so two one. Please get a sudden rush. Two, four, one. No, no, no. Don't. 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 Don't
Oh, Wait, can we please do a sneak peek? Yeah, he says DK. Hey, you always do the sneak peek. Okay. Okay, so the sneak peek's coming down here. So it's what, seven cards? Eight. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we'll put on, you guys look, just because you guys are coming up right now. And then there's the, uh, the sudden decay, so I rolled a seven. So anything seven or under is gone, but nope, nothing. What? Okay. The back, no, the one that he picked up on All right, the and away you go. Six, three, three. You can squid six and multiply to get life. Yeah. Boom, boom. Because the energy Now maybe you can kill these off in this round, too. So we have a six, three, three again. What? Oh, you got 35. Yeah, we're done. Wait, can I check? Trust your team. Okay, suggestions. Uh, the six times six is to uh, square the six, um, divide these, which is one, uh, uh, subtract 30, and then, yeah. You can get Pennywise. Mm -hmm. Pennywise. Pennywise. Wait, was it Pender's turn? Yes. No. Oh, wait, this goes away as well. Cause yes. We, oh, no. All right. So and now, because, but they started. They were the first two to start, so it ends over here now. What? So you still have three people to go oh, to yeah. kill one zombie. <laughs> yeah. Wow. What's happening now? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. Add, add this. Add this. Add all of them. Add <laughs> all of them. Kill them. Okay. Now we got more zombies people. don't stand a chance. Can we keep this a high score too? Nope. Now we keep a class high score, but um. Not this one. Not this one because it's not the the regular teams because we have a bus cancellation today, so there's a lot of students missing. I hope there's no sudden. No sudden. Oh yeah, we did six. There was okay. okay. So energy drink. Oh, I love all the easy numbers. Yeah. Oh, all this goes there. No, but that goes. But next is <laughs> gonna be the hard numbers. Yeah, we have. Yeah, so it's time all right, to use so that. So starting here. No, but like this no. is gonna be your last turn, man. Oh yeah. Oh my God. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. These are gonna be so hard, right? You're the bad thing I killed Okay, so we have, we have a 2-2-1. Two, two, okay, we got the 5 2 2 Okay, I got it. Give, so give you him his time. Get the so you do 2 plus 2 there, because there's 4, and then plus 1. Okay, or, you can do, or you can do 2 plus 2, then you close to 4 times 1. But then let's take the... But then let's take, yeah, yeah, just, just, just wait, just wait, just wait. The 4, the 4. Because okay. then he eats more. Wait, 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 wait. Yes? 2 times 2 equals 4, and then you can... Yeah. Or you can get five. Okay. I saw that. Or, or how could you get the five? You could square this and add one. Yeah, I saw okay. that too. So. Let's get the five out and the one four. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Enough. So we're getting two. We hopefully win this round. Oh, I don't think there's a danger of that. <laughs> at this point. Wait, the time is up. Like a lot. By a lot. Nobody cares. Nobody's here at school today. Yeah. Yeah. Nobody. I'm cutting that part out of the video. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody cares. Nobody yeah. cares. How do you do that? <laughs> boom, boom. And all we need is that, 10. Uh, that's that's yeah. Yeah. Yeah, true. No, we're obviously going to get 10. Like all right, so 633. Three, um, no. Yeah, mm. you can do a square oh, six, a yeah. divide by six, a add this, and use and add these two. I told you. Snack. Okay, so sorry. Yeah, I told you. You're, you're, you're talking very quickly. Speak clear numbers for our audience here. Three times three, which is nine, divided by three, which equals three, plus the six, which equals nine, and we use this to add our energy drink to add one, which makes ten. Yeah, let's do Boom, this. Son. Yeah. Okay, wait, are we done now? You see me rolling. So the, the plane lands, and we get three Many more survivors. survivors. The plane's so small. How come I get so many? How many survivors <laughs> do you want? <laughs> hey, no, wait, are like, these people, they're also humans. <laughs> can we get the survivors? Can yeah, can them? we? No, the heroes stay behind. They, they, they go help other, other cities that need their help. Can you do the ending part? Uh, and we usually don't do the ending just because it's um, it's boring. Yeah. That's not that it's boring. It's just it would be for people who continually play the game because they'll say like these survivors one is not usable in the next game and that kind of stuff. We're, you know, we just want to concentrate on, on. I don't think we beat the high it. score for the. Let's see. So three, five, six, nine, eleven, thirteen, seventeen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-eight, twenty-nine. 
So there's a lot of fours left in here. That's the problem. We, um, our, our class high score is currently 41. But that was City of Zombies. That is a playthrough of City of Zombies. And you can see how the students think and how they uh, are, are really using a lot of great math skills to, to do this. And we do this every morning. And it'll really take, you know, if we don't finish in the first 10 minutes, then when we come back from recess, we'll wrap it up then. Uh, but it's just, uh, we do it on a daily basis. And the, the, the results are really paying off. We're really seeing improvement in the math skills of all the students. And it's, uh, it's wonderful to see. So highly recommend this game. Go away. You're going to scare the audience. <laughs> okay. And I'll take you to my closing thoughts. Well, that's going to wrap it up for today's episode. If you have any questions about City of Zombies or if you have any other ideas for things you might like to see on the channel, any other games that I uh, use in the class that you might like to see the students playing, please leave me a message in the comment section below. But until next time, I'm Craig Thompson with the Board Game Teacher saying thanks for coming to the classroom. Are you coming back to school with me? We could have done it all so easily. Thompson when I'm a Board Game Teacher. I'm going to teach you about board games. <laughs> <laughs>